All right, let's do a stogie cam short for the kitties. Millennials, you know, they drop off after about 90 seconds. So, kitties, vote. Uh, uh, I think in all states, you can do it online. Just Google vote or register to vote, and uh, you'll get to the official site. Hopefully, you won't get to some spoof site that the cocksucking Republicans set up. Uh, go to the site, register, and then vote. Yeah, vote. It's easy. You just look for these this string, uh, D E M O C R A T, and then press the button that says "Vote Entire Ticket." I don't even want Republican dog catchers elected because they'll implement a Trumpian vision of dog catching. Uh, you know, first they'll round up all of the illegal immigrant dogs and deport them or put them to sleep. That's really what they wish they could do. But uh, we still got that damn Constitution. <clears throat> and separation of powers. Trump's still working that one. You mean the judiciary can overrule my bullshit? Yeah, yeah, the judiciary can and does regularly overrule your bullshit. Because uh, now uh, it's not just white Anglo-Saxon Protestants who have lawyers. The rest of us have lawyers, too. I've got a lawyer. Everybody has a lawyer. So even though you cut all the funding for the pro bono legal aid people, uh, doesn't matter. Lawyers are just offering their services for free just to shove it up your fucking ass, you piece of shit, Donald Trump, and your fucking lunatic 35% base. Hey, idiots, here's, here's an idea. When we impeach and, and convict this idiot and remove him from office in disgrace, get your red state governor to secede from the union and uh, get your little toy guns and your little Confederate flags and take to the streets. Because that way, we can have a, a Civil War do-over. Uh, but, but this time, the General Sherman solution, uh, which he was well on his way to completing when Lincoln ended hostilities and let the re rebels disarm and go home and therefore infect future generations with their hate and willful ignorance. Well, I guess some of it was just ignorance, ignorance. Uh, this time, there's not going to be no Lincoln. There's not going to be no premature peace. This time, we kill every red rebel, every red sympathizer, and, and we just keep killing them till they're all dead. Okay, all, all of them. All, all, all. And so that's, the, that's, what, that's what I'm uh, thinking is going to happen. Because this breach that this lunatic demagogue has created, it, it, it's not really fixable. The country is ungovernable, and as long as those idiots are still alive, it will remain at risk. We're going to eliminate the risk this time. Okay? So, if, if I could, I'd press the button and start playing the Battle Hymn of the Republic for you. Uh, but I, I, it's already three minutes. Sorry, millennials. Three minutes. You'll, you'll be okay. Vote Democratic every election for the rest of your life. Okay? And if a, if a, if a Bernie runs and loses the nomination, I, I hope you're clear on not forgetting to vote or voting for a third-party candidate and given a, a, a Republican uh, the presidency uh, or, or congressional seats or, or Senate seats, this time and every time from now on, vote straight Democratic. I guess if there's some state where there's like a nut Democrat and a very, very, very liberal Republican, between you and me, you can vote for that Republican. But vote straight Democratic for the rest of them. Thank you. Peace out. Andrew Paul Scatino, Why Women Are So Problematic, a memoir and irreverent, whimsical polemic. If you want to see that book, you got to go to my GoFundMe page and give me some bread so I can afford to finish it and, and self-publish it. Uh, Google my name, S-C-H-E-T-T-I-N-O. You'll find uh, that GoFundMe site and, and all the rest of my stuff, my blog, everything on LinkedIn, Facebook. It's, it's, it's good stuff. Remember Joe Stalin's quote, Why Tax the Rich When I Can Kill Them? Yeah. Cough it up. One percenters, give up your obscene wealth voluntarily, or we're going to come and get it.